All right, Ben, uh, most of our nights ended with the folks from Twist on Angel, and our day is beginning with the yeah, folks from Twist on yeah. Angel. <laughs> Joining us this morning in the uh, Roadshow Kitchen, it's uh, Chef Rob and Jeff Talmore, who are here this morning with um, cocktails and also some food as well. He's what do you always, got, guys? He's always got cocktails. <laughs> it's, eight, it's happy it's hour eight, somewhere, eight right? 15. <laughs> he's always trying to get someone to drink a cocktail. So, so what do you got? Basically, what we're doing, we're not doing anything too intense because half of your staff is a little, a little tipsy and <laughs> a little tired. And ours yeah. is a little tired too. So we're just doing some simple things. We're going to make caprese skewers. It's perfect for the holiday season, and we're going to do some lamb lollipops, which is just like a, a little one rib chop from the, the French rack of lamb, and it's just grilled and served with. Uh, uh, a horseradish mint mayo aioli type thing. Right, we, I had a few of those last night at Twist on Angel. And Jeff, what are you sipping over there? That doesn't look like scope. This is this is <laughs> this, this is a, <laughs> this is a Ben Haig Blues Martini, which oh, we're going to be doing shortly. Yeah, man. yeah, that, to the guy. He, yeah, he's going to be jobless <laughs> shortly, very shortly. <laughs> <laughs> you got any you got any uh, help wanted signs up over there? You, you need I, them. I, I mean, need I need his wash your bad. So yeah, I mean, yeah. we'll put an apron on him and get him in the kitchen. Yeah, and get yeah, him to work. He'd, he'd be great. Yeah, yeah. yeah did, did he break anything last night, Ben? Uh, a few things. He was actually dancing on the bar. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> Good to know. Ben's going video, out with a bang. Yeah, we have yeah. a video of that? All right. All right. We'll show that at his going away party. <laughs> Guys, thanks so much for last night and uh, for Thank coming you. in with us bright yeah, and early this morning. Find the recipe and the ingredients online at foxprovidence.com. Back to you. That's right, Court. I'll tell you what, we're here with Jeff Talmore from Twist on Angel. Thanks so much, by the way, last night. You threw yeah. a heck of a party. No, one thing you knew, you always dress to impress, but you threw a heck of a party. So congratulations on that. Uh, one of the signature cocktails last night, which I did take a picture of and, and send it to my mother who's oh, down in did. Florida, is the Ben Haig Blue Teeny. I want to let everybody know at home, there's no blues on this guy. I had a, I had a wonderful year. I enjoyed my time. I wish uh, Michaela the best of luck. But wh where did this, who inspired this drink? Obviously, besides, besides the plight of my career, how did this drink come about and, uh, and what's in it? Just, just wanted to do something different here. So uh, what we did was we took some double cross vodka, okay, a little bit of uh, Caravella limoncello, some blue curacao, and a little Where bit of Where do we get something mix. like this, by the way? Is this at oh, liquor stores? Or yeah, you, yeah, okay. that, that's readily available. So we do a couple ounces of the uh, double cross. Nice and cold there in a chilled, oh, yeah. uh, chilled mixer filled yeah, to the top ice. of ice. Let it be known to the general public out there, I normally don't drink uh, hot, hot aqua blue drinks, but, uh, <laughs> <laughs> but for the purposes of this we segment, I will. <laughs> little lemon cello. little right. lemon cello. I did try it last night. I figured I had to. And uh, it did. It, had that, it, it was a sweet drink. It had a, uh, you know, that lemon cello really, really comes out with it. Oh, yeah. Which was nice. And what did we end up here with? Uh, a little bit of sour mix. A little bit of sour mix. All right. And given the nature Just of your like position. Just like I'm, I'm sour over the, uh, over the end of my career. Here we go. <laughs> here we go. I like it. This is an interview. Here. You didn't have to tell uh, America, by the way, that I was dancing on the bar last night. You didn't have to say that. Yes. Did, did I say that or did you say that? Uh, you said it earlier and I just reiterated that. Oh, all right. All right. Let's see if we can do this here. Come on. This is why oh. I'm not a bartender. All right. Get I'll our strainer. That. There you go. You're going to try the first one with me? This is oh, yeah. for this, man. Hey. Oh, that's nice. Jeff, look, look at, at that. that. Jeff Talmore on Twist look on Angel. That. Can people go in and request this? And will oh, your yeah, bartender absolutely. still know how to do absolutely. it? Absolutely. All right. And if they mention my name that I sent them there, will that give them a dollar off or something? I'm just, yeah, we'll do it. We'll just giving away drinks at your store. <laughs> yeah, with, with that being said, we'll do it for five bucks. All right, How's beautiful, beautiful. Twist on Angel, five dollar the Ben Haig Blue Teeny. But you know what? You'll be smiling after a few of these. Let's That's go back right. to you guys. We are back at the Roadshow Kitchen this morning with Twist on Angel. You guys have been feeding us for the last 24 hours. Yes. We ate with you last night at the Search for the Star finale. Now we're cooking up some great appetizers that were actually featured at the event last night. Yes. We've got uh, Chef Rob here, and we are making caprese skewers yep. and lamb lollipops. Lamb lollipops. We don't like the lollipop term. It's so. the, the term lamb lollipop we'll just kind of call it like, We'll just bit, call it like a ham, ham a, a lamb, 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 lamb on a stick. On a stick. There you <laughs> go. Lamb on a stick. Lamb All on right. a bone. So basically what we're going to do is we're going to sear this on a super hot, this, this is cast iron, so I, I warned Michaela, she, her on second time in the kitchen, she needs to watch out because okay. this is going to sear and it might, might okay. see, Ooh, I mean, it, it, good. Yeah. and then we're going to put rosemary and thyme like right on it next to it because mm -hmm. that'll like infuse some of the like the flavor and the smell. Yum. This is a real substantial appetizer. That's what I love about, about the lamb lollipop. Yeah, the, I mean it. You know? It's something different, too. It's not something yeah. you see all the time. And, uh, I mean, but we did throw in the caprese skewers, which is just, you can go ahead and start yeah, making those up. Yeah, it's super easy. And I have to say, Chef Rob, 
you know, caprese salad obviously yeah, is hugely everybody popular knows what that in is. the summer, but this is a nice way to transition it to, into the holidays. First yeah. of all, the colors are perfect, the yeah. red and the green, yeah. and very easy to make. So you're just going to skewer your what? Your cherry tomato. Yeah, cherry tomato. You, yep. you got some fresh mozzarella right here. Okay. There's some basil leaves, and you can make them as big as you like, but like with the uh, hors d'oeuvre thing that we did last night for right. you guys. Obviously, like one bite, two bites tops. Right. It's probably the best thing. So. And that's what's so great about salad is, you know, I'm I'm a big salad lover myself, and a lot of people, you know, that's not really easy to eat. It's yeah. not, you know, you got the plate going and a fork, yeah. so this is nice. It's kind of, you know, salad on it's the. It's kind of like a salad. On, yeah, there you go. <laughs> You've got to cover it both on a stick. Now, what we're gonna serve with the lamb lollipop is a. It's called a horseradish mint aioli. Usually, okay. you see like a mint chutney or like okay. a mint jelly, like back in the '80s and stuff like that at your <laughs> grandma's table. But yeah, I'm not really a fan of of, of mint chutney. So basically, okay. to make okay. aioli, you you're gonna just we got the blender here. It's usually uh, oh well, it's always one egg yolk. We're okay. gonna throw two in there because ah, that's what so we have in the jar. For good right. measure. Vinegar. Mm -hmm. Dijon mustard. This isn't going to come out yeah, for you me. want the skewer? Yeah, yeah. There's, a, there's a spoon, a spoon right there. There you go. There you go. Thank you very much. Sorry to go across you. There you go. And that'll go in there sooner or later. There we go. It's in. And we're just going to kind of zip it. And just like you would do like a dressing, you just kind of uh, pulse in mm -hmm. really slowly. Mm -hmm. You pulse in a little bit of oil. Thicken it up a bit. And I'm going to shut it off because I'm not going to make a mess. <laughs> And this is what it finishes. Then you would you would fold in at the end. So you can kind of see in the blender how it yeah, starts. But this is up. the finished product. And it, the horseradish thickens it more. And then it, you just chop in the mint. And then that's the finished product. And that's Great. so easy. I mean, yeah. look, it took you, what, two minutes to zip that up? Yeah, and we're going to flip these. And these are cooking have cool fast. Color. Yeah, get in there. There you go. Ah. And you can kind of yeah. smell the, the rosemary in it. Yeah, time, oh, like, it smells great. Given that, that flavor. And then we're just going to take Spoon some, some oh. butter. Okay. Because, I mean, butter makes everything better. Yeah, make it glisten. It'll uh -huh. glisten. It'll add flavor. And it'll just, like, nice. rub it around. you got to massage your meat. You know you what I'm too, saying? You do, right? Right. It's like a massage you would get at home. You massage your meat to make it feel good. Yeah, make it feel tender. Make it feel nice. How long are we cooking that for? Um, lamb is best served at medium rare. Some okay. people like it a little well done because uh -huh. it does have kind of a gamey meat. It does, it's yeah. It's got a little gamey flavor. And it, the animal being so young, you know, it doesn't have that chance to grass feed or whatever. Yeah. So, so, so it has a little bit of game in it. All right, so we have our lamb lollipop. Uh, lamb. <laughs> Let's try that again. Lamb lollipops <laughs> finishing up. We've got these appetizers. You guys have the Ben Hague blue teeny too. That's nice. Jeff. Jeff. Mixing Jeff it all together. Jeff loves to shove the like drinks down people's throats, which is a good thing if you really oh, enjoy drink. that. Let's pass oh, that go down. For it. Yeah. Go for it. Take and then obviously caprese skewers, you always kind of see balsamic. So this is a balsamic reduction, kind of mm -hmm. Google that. Oh, wow. Maybe some uh, olive oil. And just, you know, enjoy it. Yeah, you got to make it look pretty, yeah, obviously, yeah. when you're passing it out to your guests. Let me Everything this looks back here. smells delicious. And look at they're already done cooking. Yeah, I they're, mean, they're good. These are quick, easy appetizers, which, especially perfect during holiday, the holidays, yeah, perfect you don't holiday. have that much time. Picking so food. it's great. Don't you think, find two people at parties now, especially where there's so many, they want to load up. We just want a nice couple mm -hmm. of beautiful appetizers and we're good to go. I and mean, it's all about the Last night cocktails. you had tons of people there. We yeah, could have done yeah. 40 different hors d'oeuvres. Oh, but, yeah. I mean, realistically, there's only a handful of things that people really enjoy. Yeah. Obviously, the caprese salad, so on a skewer. Right. Everybody loves some sort of meat, and we just figured, you know, lamb might be the way to go. So. Well, listen, we appreciate everything. We had a great time last night at Twist on Angel. I'm, I'm glad you oh do. God. And I for, mean, for people who haven't be been in a while, yeah, please come. great um, location. So. Yeah, awesome location on the east side. Yeah. New menu. Well, thanks again for Lots taking care of us for the last 24 hours. None Congratulations. Of us are Thank you very much. Take Thank care. you very much Happy always.